He, the British royal family, has always been the subject of great curiosity by the public and recent revelations about Catherine, the Princess of Wales, have only heightened the scrutiny as the important trooping the colour ceremony approaches. The anticipation surrounding Catherine's potential appearance is noticeable. If she joins the royal family on the Buckingham Palace balcony, it would be her first official appearance in public in 2024, which would surely attract lots of attention. Royal fans all over the world are eagerly waiting to see her spectacular appearance at that historic event. We have some very interesting news to share about Catherine's new role. King Charles was encouraged to make Princess Catherine a lady of the Order of Garter because she deserves it. As the royal family prepares for a very busy royal week, the Order of the Garter is known as the oldest and highest royal honor in Britain given by the monarch. With this honor coming up next week, former royal butler Paul Burl talked about why he believes the king rewards those closest to him. He's hoping the king will give Princess Catherine this prestigious honor. If the monarch does this, it will make big headlines as she deserves it for being our future queen and the Princess of Wales. It's time for her to join this distinguished group. Mr. Burl also said such honors should be given fairly, recognizing many ordinary people in Britain who deserve celebration for their work. The king likes to honor those around him with royal titles and gifts to show his affection and appreciation for their service to him and the country. In a display of resilience and unity, the royals prepare for an emotional trooping the color celebration amid ongoing health challenges. With Princess Catherine undergoing preventative chemotherapy, her potential attendance has become a focal point of public interest and affection for the royal family. The princess recently apologized for missing the rehearsal. Later, King Charles met with the Irish guards amid the preparations. An emotional moment is anticipated. Sources close to the royal family suggest Catherine, known for her deep empathy and strong family bonds, may find it difficult not to shed tears during King Charles's emotional speech at the parade. The speech is expected to reflect on the challenges faced by the monarchy and the personal struggles of both Charles and Catherine. This touching scene showed the continued support and appreciation for the regiment's contributions. According to a royal source, King Charles would be delighted to have Princess Catherine join the royal celebration. It revealed how the royal family dynamic looks different without her presence. If Catherine were to appear on the balcony, it would definitely dominate news headlines. This comment follows the announcement that she won't appear to take the salute as Colonel of the Irish Guards, a ceremonial role and responsibility within the royal family. But from all that's been seen and read, one would imagine the king would be very happy to have her there. It would reinforce the strength of the monarchy going forward, which some have questioned with both the king and Catherine facing recent health concerns. In another revelation that has shocked the British monarchy, Queen Camilla disclosed Catherine's distress over King Charles's determination not to slow down despite apparent good health on his part. The candid admission offers a rare glimpse into the inner workings of the royal family and has sparked widespread concern among those observing the royals. Reports from palace insiders say Catherine was seen crying as she overheard a conversation between Queen Camilla and novelist Lee Child where she expressed her deep unhappiness over King Charles's unrelenting pace and refusal to follow advice, despite assurances of the king's well-being. Queen Camilla lamented that he won't slow down and do as he's told, painting a troubling picture of the monarch's reluctance to listen to guidance from his close advisors.